As a libero, reaction time is critical. It's a game of beating the ball to the floor. I'm Laura Larson. I'm the libero on the U of A volleyball team, and this is the science behind the dig. First of all, you are going to have to look at the hitter. Where is she approaching and what angle is she coming towards you? So right after the ball leaves the setter's hands, you know, I'm making that first move. You know, I'm trying to do all those things in half a second and make the right read and then react to it. A typical spike travels around 60 miles per hour, giving Laura less than 0.3 seconds to dig the ball before it hits the floor. It takes Laura's brain about a quarter of a second to see the shot and begin to react leaving less than a tenth of a second to make her final move. I think physics is a huge thing in volleyball. Taking these classes that I've taken has really helped me with that. I'm conscious of it while I play, and that's what's so fun about science to me. Chevron Human Energy Stories, explaining the STEM behind the game.